This is Chris with this week's Back to Basics segment in which we're going to break down the basic push-up. Now when we talk about the push-up, this is one of the foundational exercises we use to get strong here at Peak Fitness and really one of the most important exercises you're going to do um, for upper body strength. Um, some common errors that we often see in a push-up are people dipping at the hips, shrugging the shoulders, and really not segmenting correctly, either leading with the upper or the lower body. And Really with the push-up, it's just a matter of elevation, meaning if you can't do a proper push-up on the floor, the first step is to simply elevate onto a step. Alright, notice that made things a little bit easier. If you still find that you're sagging down or segmenting up, you can move to a higher surface like a bench. Or even a wall. Now, the other really main thing that we see with the push-up is a shrugging of the shoulders. A lot of people do this, they get the tension, they shrug their shoulders as they're coming up, when we want to keep their shoulder blades down and back. A push-up is also a great exercise for the back because the, the back muscles have to stabilize. To kind of uh, get the emphasis of doing that, we want to keep the elbows down. We want to really shrug these back muscles here. So as I'm coming back, I'm pulling the shoulder blades down as opposed to having my elbows up here where I'm shrugging. Okay, in order to do so, um, we want to learn to kind of retract our shoulder blades. I'm going to show you a great exercise to do so. This is just called a pullback. And what I'm doing here is I'm tensing these muscles. I'm sticking my chest out and I'm just pulling back. Just kind of getting the feeling of kind of pulling back. You can kind of see how this would relate to a push-up motion. But you kind of practice it this way. I'm keeping my shoulder blades down, really feeling my lats engage. And then we just transfer that motion to the basic push-up. Okay, now what some criteria I look for with the push-up, if you could do eight reps um, you know, on a surface like a bench, it's time to move down until we get to the floor. Once you can get to the floor, we're going to elevate your feet up and just come up and down. You know, some things that, to think about, keep the abs tight, make sure the shoulder blades are down and back, elbows tucked in, and that's the way you progress a perfect push-up.